What's the deal with airplane peanuts? What I like to do is do stand up, get hammered, and then listen to motivating rap. Oh fuck yeah! On the Uber home, <laughs> looking over the skyline, <laughs> <laughs> just like, dude, I did it. I'm yeah. the best. I'll then I wake up it. and I go, what the fuck was I doing last night? <laughs> yeah. Oh no! Oh fuck! <laughs> I'm a fucking loser. <laughs> it's all gonna be really bad again. <laughs> dude, that it's... happens every once in a while. I'll just get a wave of like, oh no, it's happening again. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone hates me again. That has to be a hot feeling in the face. It's Dude, a that's wild feeling. crazy. Yeah, that has was, to be some fucking heat for your head. I know I've told this story a thousand times, but getting canceled, I was on a train yeah, yeah, yeah. going to the stand. Yeah, I've heard this. And just getting canceled <laughs> in between stops. Like, cause I do, I would lose service, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then the next That's stop, I'd be like, holy shit! The One next stop, thousand new tweets. Yeah, yeah. And then the next stop, I was like, I don't remember saying that. I didn't say that. <laughs> didn't you say that people were like, people were like looking down at their phone and then like looking well, yeah, up? At yeah, yeah. <laughs> Several times. <laughs> That's yeah. insane. When I got canceled, I had zero dollars, so I was, you know, taking the train, taking yeah. the mega bus. People would be like. Is this you? <laughs> That's fucked. It's me. It's the not mega going well. Bus. Yeah. The mega bus from $1. New York to Philly. Yeah. Oh, man. The Chinatown That's bus. Mm -hmm. That's fucking bad. Dude, you must have been like, you got to be like top five worst cancels. Yeah. I mean, aside from like, <laughs> fuck. Yeah, outside of like yeah, yeah. sexual yeah, predators. Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I'm up there. Yeah. Did you play sports? In, yeah, I played football. And football? basketball, yeah. I was just telling someone, do you remember wearing a girdle? Yeah. When you... Do you remember how itchy your asshole would get? Yeah. You couldn't reach it because yes. of your girdle? Do you remember post-practice dick, how small your penis would be? <laughs> Almost no one in football talks about the post-practice dick. Dude, and then go, everyone in the shower is like, yeah, I'm going to go yeah, fluff yeah, it like, up I'm a little bit. I'm going to pull coach. on my yeah. penis. I'm going to pull it out for <laughs> just a tit. When you were playing like high school or college sports and the guys were like, uh, you know, you'd shower, were there guys on your team who would like work it up a little before they came into yeah, the Yeah, I don't even know any of those guys. <laughs> guys who would like who maybe would pull on it before it. yeah get, get what are you talking there, about you know, yeah i do that before in. the doctor yeah dude do you really i've watched porn in the lobby yeah well, hell yeah hell you can't yeah. present your boy you can't show your boys a small dick so you yeah. you yeah i would sometimes accidentally go too hard and that's it <laughs> yeah that's it you got it's it's a thin line True. you're like oh calm down you know True. Yeah. It's distressing. now you can't be too hard for your boys no no but no. you can't definitely you certainly hard. can't be soft true if you're showing your boys your penis, you definitely have a semi. You have should. some respect for them. You, know? exactly. you can fucking bulldog women in a pool. Dude. <laughs> yeah. It's the only place you're allowed to physically dude, assault women. You can, <laughs> you can just fucking choke <laughs> slam them and they can grab your you arm. Baptize them, dude. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hold them up. Finishing moves yeah. all day. <laughs> dude, learn how to take a bump, ladies. You can just get in the pool. Or don't dude. get in the pool, dude. If you're a woman, you see me in the pool. <laughs> don't you come near dude, me. I, I don't care if you're you a stranger. Stay shallow end. <laughs> yeah. I'm going I'm I'm to come up from under the water swamp thing and then rock bottom you. <laughs> standing, just standing, grabbing a lady, rock bottoming her. Be <laughs> fun as hell. Oh, dude, we just uh, got I, a couple of kids on the side. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! That's my buddy Shane right there. <laughs> I go, you want to see Swamp Thing take this lady out? Dude, we so wait when quarantine started, I was in Key West. Yeah, I, I remember that. Well, there you're on your salt life. I was salt life for a couple weeks and. uh there was it was spring break in Key West, mm -hmm. so my hotel was just hot babies. <laughs> Wait, in I your pool? In the hotel and you pool. Still went to and the I pool. sat over the balcony and just oh. <laughs> drank Miller High Lights. Oh, just some but, lady, some lady but, being like, "Who's that guy?" <laughs> hey, look yeah. up. I was in the corner of hey. the hotel. Hey. But Matt, Matt, I was I was talking to Matt McCuskey, and he was like, "You should cannonball." <laughs> while the college girls are swimming mm -hmm. and then get at one of those boards and just start waiting for <laughs> rough pool just rough waves your, just by yourself <laughs> dude the thought of a solo man at spring break <laughs> coming up knife. under <laughs> but coming up under their floats and pushing them off <laughs> <laughs> and then they're like hey what are you doing <laughs> who is this guy <laughs> ew <laughs> <laughs> starting starting <laughs> yeah, a she, oh, she, oh, you guys oh. should do chicken fights yeah. 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 someone get on my back <laughs> <laughs> ew he's on me <laughs> you ever see somebody's shoes when they're taking a shit you wait outside you're like <laughs> Who was it, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Who did it? <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. Well, man, you probably crap at rest stops, right? No, never. What? Never, yeah. dude. Only hotels in my house. Really? Yeah, hotels yeah, are yeah, nice. Yeah. Well, hotels is a good yeah. call. Although, until you get into the squatty potty, that it kind of sucks when you're at a hotel. And you don't. I like. I'll look at the trash can. And I'm like, can I put my feet on yeah. this? Matt, That's they, the game. They got a portable squatty potty now. Uh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It like folds up and you put it in your oh, pocket. Man. <laughs> 
You gotta be a fat motherfucker. <laughs> I'm, bringing, I'm prepared to shit wherever I'm headed. <laughs> Dude, breaking out a squatty body at a rest stop or in an airport bathroom. <laughs> Washing. I crush seat. airports. I yeah. take shit on get, planes. I take early flights. Shitting on planes is is absolutely insane. No, it rules. It rules. <laughs> Wahlberg's gonna stop you one day. <laughs> <laughs> Wahlberg's gonna see you going. <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> true well, the move is you go when the drink cart starts to come then you go so then you take a dump but then you're standing in the back waiting mm, for yeah. the cart to come so no you one stretch knows. your legs no one knows you dumped and you just you just punish the staff you go back there and then, <laughs> <laughs> take a nest i've done it before all those I, gorgeous sluts <sighs> dude just stewardesses those- <laughs> are sluts Oh, and yeah. you get to shit back there and make the sluts go. <laughs> <laughs> all the sluts, they're all hung over from their layover. I've only flown like once. Well, t- really? Once like there and back, but like a... <laughs> True. <laughs> <laughs> You've only flown once? Yeah. <laughs> That's such a funny qualifier. Mm-hmm. Well, technically, well, technically there was twice. a return flight. <laughs> there was a return flight. Yeah. Oh, this is why my second flight was delayed. This uh, flight attendant just fainted. What? And had to go to the hospital. So then they were like, um, we need to wait another hour till the next flight attendant gets here. You would think and they could like, like 3D dude, print just those. tough it out. Yeah. <laughs> they, like, we, look, we there's got to be a slut in the, on the flight that'll dude. put the bet. <laughs> you know how when there's like a medical emergency, they're like, uh, do we have any sluts on the flight that can take over and serve fat old guys drinks? Sick move. <laughs> <laughs> and I divert it. That's legendary. Mm-hmm. So fucking funny. That's my new move to anybody out there that wants to try to heckle me. You're dude. getting hit with that. That's something you hear and you instantly want to steal. Be do like, it. I could do that. You can do, do it. it. No, I'd be happy. That's, if you your, do that's it. urine, bro. No, I'd like you to do it. Do you want to send an I'd Iyukin? like you to do. I think you. I don't know if I want you to do Hadouken, but I want you to do or just a, a fucking. No, I want you to do a. Uh, who's the Who's the Marvel guy that you liked? You're talking about. Uh, the you're guy. talking about from Street Fighter. No, no, I'm talking in Doctor. Oh, Doctor Strange. Yeah, I want you to. <laughs> If someone starts heckling you, just hit them with like a. <laughs> Dude, sending a, a fireball to someone who's heckling you is the best. Yeah, like, get to the jokes. <laughs> it would be nice if you spotted a guy kind of leaning on his chair and hit him. With that. Oh, <laughs> I mean, that would it'd be over. Dude, I might no. set up a plant. And you start sh- putting YouTube videos out about Hadouken. <laughs> and have, fall, like, have like a fake bad fall. Like, dude, that's crazy. Oh my God, guys, that's crazy. You yeah. should get, how much do you think it would cost to have security, like your own security at a comedy club who would like fucking like scared, scre- like jack people Screaming up. Screaming people's faces. Yeah, like fuck them up. Holy fuck, that'd be awesome. It'd be a couple, it'd be a few hunch. I could give a guy 50 bucks at most clubs. Uh, yeah, be like, yeah. dude, motherfuck this, dude. Yeah, Like true. if somebody talks, get in their face and be like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> I'll fuck your wife. I'll fuck your wife. <laughs> That'd be an easy fix. Yeah. Hit him with a couple of fucking, maybe a huger and like 50 bucks. <laughs> yeah, give him an Adderall. <laughs> give him a fucking huger. Give him an Adderall and be like, dude, go wild I'll on everybody. I'll give you $100 and fucking 30 milligrams of Adderall <laughs> and keep this thing totally contained. <laughs> Just seeing girl, making girls cry. Yeah. Shut up, you fucking bitch. You bitch. He has to be big enough to beat up anyone's boyfriend in the room. What are you going to do, pussy? Shut up. Get like three of them. Three giant dudes Fuck, surround dude. a table. Just three major pains, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And rain <laughs> hell on anybody. <laughs> Somebody orders too loud. Be like, boys. Get the fuck destroy out. this fucking guy <laughs> you could do this yeah not in any funny way though no yeah. no no no. like i don't i want to destroy hecklers without like wit or anything funny no just good comebacks force. just, just pure violence yeah. they don't kick him out they just stand around the table yeah. and eat his food and hoot yeah. at him oh, eat yeah. his food <laughs> jeer at his girlfriend yeah. big and revolutionary war soldiers dude yes and never stop you have to give them quarters they, they will take quarters <laughs> <laughs> we'll sit down at your table and start eating <laughs> That would be, dude. I'm telling you, you could do this and run a very tight ship. Yeah, and people be they be like, yo, whoa, chill with that. Like if they get caught with a phone, you fucking step on it. Yeah, I wonder how much it would cost to maybe rig up some type of pulley system. So if you did hit someone with a Hadouken, they flew. 
to the back of the room, you know, what I mean? or elevate, <laughs> levitated, and you force hold them. <laughs> that's what this. I thought. Shut the fuck Dude, up. Dude, that would be so sick. <laughs> you should go to helium or wherever else and, and come down like from like nine <laughs> feet from the ceiling on a cable. Because <laughs> <laughs> you could rig yourself up. Like, if they start getting you mad, you start levitating. Dude, <laughs> if, you, if you were all black and they put you up in the ceiling and after the feature, like the hose comes back out, <laughs> you slowly descend from seven feet. <laughs> You've been there the whole time. You've been up <laughs> <laughs> you could do this, dude. <laughs> How dedicated well, are you? Be, I'd be so happy. What <laughs> would be so funny is if they noticed me during the fe- <laughs> during the feature set, just on the roof, like a bat, dude. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to trick out the lighting so you can't be seen. <laughs> Descend slowly. Yeah. A true, a true vampiric entrance. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh, there's so much sick shit you could do. Yeah, if you got pulled out and I was supposed to be levitating, but I was too heavy, so my feet just dragged. <laughs> you watch your whole special or no? I had to. Yeah, I had to. I was for that. the edit. To that get was very edit. hard. Yeah, I was trying not to and. A lot of people are like you have to do that. Yeah, I could see that, so, especially because it's long. Yeah, listening to something, I could listen to something of myself for like a minute, but yeah. uh, almost an hour. It's nice to. I watched it with someone who hadn't seen it yet. Yeah, yeah, and that was nice because they were laughing. The I was like, all right, good. That's that fine. would make yeah. me so uncomfortable. Putting it on in front of someone. Yeah, yeah, that's a very weird thing to you do. You ever just pull up and then halfway through you realize you're doing it and you're like, I'm a fucking psycho, <laughs> like holding a phone, like watch this. Yeah, and it's yeah, me yeah. telling a joke. <laughs> it's like, Dude. You want to just say it? You want to just yeah, say the why joke? Don't you do, yeah. Why don't you just be funny <laughs> here? Yeah. Cut out the middleman. Look real at this quick. time I was funny in Texas <laughs> yeah. a year ago. So Kodak Black. Kodak Jones. Black. Yeah, Kodak Black's from there. He's from around Mar-Lago. Palm Beach. Yeah, so he chills at, with Trump Dad. I mean, he calls him his unk, dude. That's does my call Trump his unk? He did Caleb Presley's uh, interview show on Barstool. It's one of the funniest things. Oh, yeah, I saw clips it's of insane. that. Yeah. He's insane. He's insane. But like, he's like, he's like uh, Trump white. wrote this. Could you read this? And he's like, what's up, blood? What's up, cuz? Is your unk Trump? <laughs> he's like, he goes, he's like, do you like Donald Trump? He's like, that's my Gemini twin. He is super gremlin. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny, dude. Yeah, he, he calls rules. him a super gremlin. And yeah. then he... Super gremlin. <laughs> it's also, he does have a good song on there. It starts off like, what's up, Kodak Black? He's like, my name Kodak Black, but when you see me, I'm white. I saw that, yeah. <laughs> it's so good, dude. Yeah, I saw That was the part I saw. That part's tight. Kodak the- Black grabbed his mom's ass, dude, on a dance floor. What? He's a super gremlin, dude. Yeah, but Kodak Black's a little different than me. True. I mean, <laughs> he's not going to get any voters out of me. True. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Unless you come out with a song like, my name's Shane Gillis, but I'm black. <laughs> my name's Shane Gillis. When, when you see me, I'm black. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what the baby said. Quest Love oh, came at the baby. The baby was the like, baby? no disrespect. I'm not trying to be a dick. I don't know who that is. Fair. <laughs> that's a great response. <laughs> who? <laughs> You think the baby ever watched Jimmy Fallon? Hell no, dude. No. <laughs> no. no. Dude, yeah. thugs don't watch Jimmy Fallon. No. <laughs> that See, barely that. reaches normal white people. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally designed just for dorky white yeah. people. Okay. True. That's like, yeah. That's like the nerdiest guy in every office is like, oh, perfect. Did you catch yeah. Fallon last night? <laughs> Got a little heated there. The guy from The Office was on Fallon last night. <laughs> yeah. I love The Office. <laughs> That's so when more, worlds collide. Yeah. yeah. When they start making like, what's that guy? Helms? Chris Helms? Oh, no. Ed, 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 Ed Helms. Ed Helms, like yeah. jump on boxes or something. That yeah. gets or like, silly, play dude. like pie face with Jimmy Fallon. Dude, the office is probably <laughs> with buzzing. With drunk Jimmy Fallon. <laughs> is he an alcoholic? <laughs> yeah. Like a, allegedly like a raging alcoholic, which does make the show a lot better. Yeah. That's kind of nice to know. Which yeah. does make, because every once in a while you can see he's got the full moon face, like the full alcoholic face he's where he's just, just like, hey, everybody. <laughs> Whoa, we've got a great cast. Wait, I don't even know. What's the late night scape look like? Jimmy Kimmel survived Jimmy blackface, Kimmel. right? Jimmy Kimmel yeah. and Jimmy Fallon both survived blackface. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, they both blackface. I yeah. wonder, is there like a skull and bones for like the late night? Yeah. You got to do blackface. Absolutely. Jerk off. Like the bushes jerk off to you in blackface. <laughs> oh, man. There's a, the guy, Corden, James Corden. Yeah, I, yeah. I've seen some of his videos. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's pretty fucking brutal. He gets wacky. I've heard he's cool. Yeah. 
firsthand accounts i've heard he's the man yeah from dudes that have done the mm -hmm. late night like the sketch but uh Man, that guy sucks. <laughs> God, he seems, I'm sure he's great, but man, he's such a dork, dude. Just like, in case he ever gets back to him, he's a nice guy. He's a great Jesus guy. He seems Christ, like a great guy, but sucks. man, what a fucking gay <laughs> pussy that guy is. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, can't forget about Trevor Noah. Trevor Noah rules. Yeah, he might be the king. Of yeah, he tells it. He kicks. He, he tells you know, it exactly. Yeah, he tells like it like it is. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> He's finally, a straight shooter. Finally, yeah. somebody telling like it is on the late night circuit for sure. I heard his uh, stand up was very. Uh, he had a couple rough he, ones. He made fun of like he would make fun of like indigenous people. Yeah, mm. he got in trouble for that. He had to Did go he? to like an indigenous museum. Did he really? Yeah. And look at their arts and crafts. You can go craft. to museum and be like, <laughs> nah, you probably saw like <laughs> some, arts and some clay yeah. stuck to a leaf. And be like, wow, this is yeah. powerful. I never, whoa, I never thought of it like, like that. Hold on, Hillary Clinton's calling me. Okay, show me your like beehive thing. Yeah. Okay, Let me yeah. see this bowl. Is that a spear made out of rocks? Whoa. whoa. A 10,000 year old bowl? I guess I never thought of it like that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know you guys were capable of spoons. <laughs> Friday night, okay. Phoenix, I get done. There's a guy out at the bar, and I'm walking by him, and he goes, that was the worst fucking show I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> mm. And I thought, I was so serious, I, th I thought he was joking. So I was like, oh, thanks for coming out, man. He was like, no, that was a piece of shit show. <laughs> Me and my wife walked out, and we've been out here the whole time. Waiting. Why? And dude, I have no idea. I couldn't figure out why. It could have been the Navy SEAL stuff, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was. I think it was. He looked Did you like tell a, him that you, were, uh, you went to West Point? <laughs> what? What would that mean? <laughs> you, you went there for the thing. You're in the military. Weeks. I was there for three weeks. I was in weeks. the ROTC in high no, school, but you, so. But you played for fucking Air Force or Army. Which no, was... I quit right away. Oh, I thought you were like no. in a, I thought you were a jarhead. No. <laughs> no. I thought he was. Anyway, I get out there. This guy work? hits me with. Yeah. This looks like you a guy I who served? served. Yeah, this looks like a guy who did. This potatoes. guy defended our country. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I served. Yeah. <laughs> so this could have been in the culinary section for <laughs> yeah, sure. Been but I don't know. I thought you. I thought Hold you on, did your me, time. Yeah, this guy hit me with that was the worst fucking show I've ever seen. And he yeah. looked like and I. I like. I usually don't get mad, but I was like, you're a fucking pussy. Like, right to his face in front of his wife. And people had to, like, separate us after the show. Wow. Did he do yeah. anything? No, he didn't. Well, either did I. But, but no, called I called him, him a pussy, pussy, and that was the end of it. But then he has to do something to you to prove he's not a pussy. I know. I was surprised I didn't get punched. He's a pussy. Yeah, it yeah. turns out he's a pussy. Yeah, you, yeah. Proved, you were right. You were he was like right. a big 55-year-old man who would have, and it sucked too because it was right in front of the Skin line. Color? White, but yeah. he was from Phoenix, so like dark, Tan. leathery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah there yeah, was yeah. a, the line for the next show was right there watching. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> and this guy's like, that was the worst piece of shit I've ever seen. And then you fight. And then I get in a fight with them. <laughs> and everyone was like, holy shit, dude. It's going to be a wild show. But weirdly, isn't it kind of, it's almost what you want them to do? Like, you don't want him to have that interaction during the show. And I'm during sure that's happened to you before. Yeah. Last time I was there, that room. Really? Yeah. Same guy. Probably. <laughs> He's like, I gave you a second chance. Dude, there was a guy who yelled the N word last time I was there. White or black? White. He was related to Shane, obviously. No, this was. <laughs> it wasn't. He wasn't one of my. Yeah, yeah. The fuck? He wasn't one Where of my. Where have you been all these years? <laughs> yeah. No, what happened? There was a comedian before me that was black that was doing a joke about fucking a white chick and her saying the n word or something like that. It wasn't. Ten minutes later, this guy's just like, "How come we can't say it?" Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> and the, the comedian had Asperger's, so he was very like, Wait, whoa, whoa. "Who? Who? Who? What? What are who you saying?" What, what? And the guy was like, "How come I can't say?" No. Oh. And, it, and the, everyone in the room was just like, what the fuck? Is that? <laughs> and I was about to go on. I was standing there just like, show's over. And that ruined the show. He got kicked out, obviously. He, he yeah, said it yeah, yeah, yeah. once yeah, or twice. And then his it. wife started chanting Biden. Wait. Like, ironically, I guess. Like, Biden. Bi yeah. He was like, this is Biden's America. We're not even allowed to say the N-word in public anymore. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, liberals ruin this country. Dude, dude. liberals ruin it. You're not allowed to scream <laughs> the N-word in, in the middle of a show. <laughs> I brought that up. Bring that up in Arizona next time you're there. It'd be like, Trump lost here, right? The whole crowd would be like, no, he did. Freak <laughs> <Yeah. Break> out. <laughs> yeah. I was like, you guys got to let him go, dude. Let it go. Did you mention it when you came back home? Yeah, I did 10 minutes on it. What'd you say? You have to. Just like hell Michael yeah. Richards just went for it. <laughs> hell yeah, brother. Started a show for I said, bring him back in, dude. Yeah. <laughs> bring that Patriot back in. Don't take him out. <laughs> He's going to love my set. <laughs> I was walking right in Chinatown. I was walking past this. Uh, there, I was walking into a shop yeah. to get some water, and there was Brave a. You. 
homeless lady just clearly dead. Yeah. What? Like a black lady on the ground, like clearly ODing. And I like stared at her for a second. And I was like, all right, I'm just going to go into this shop. Yeah. And then when I came out, people were like helping her. And I had to stop and be like, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> like, what a fucking dastardly thing to do. I'm sexually awakening you. It's like, you fucking yeah. bastard. Yeah, you're trying to come. Because he, dude, was you he read this guy's book, book, he could have got any of us. Yeah. This book was great. Yeah. He's like the uh, the waters of pleasure, but an inch deep. When you sip from them, you come up with sand in your mouth. Yeah, you never want to look like, up. Okay. You never <laughs> want to look up the author. Yeah, he got I read it. fucking, there's this book, it's called Mein Kampf. <laughs> 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 and then I Googled the guy who wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out, imagine being like, "What?" <laughs> yeah, just discovering Hitler. What the <laughs> fuck? I leave tomorrow. I'm doing a show in Philly, and then I'm in Texas for a couple of days. Oh fuck nice. yeah! With nice. Bert Kreischer. Oh fuck, fuck yeah! That'll, yeah. Be, that'll be fun. You gonna pop the top with him? I'm gonna drink a little. Yeah, you should. <laughs> we asked you if you wanted beers in here, <laughs> and uh, <laughs> dude, I, I gotta take one day off. Can you? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, what do you mean? God, <laughs> God damn, dude. I've been getting hit with this a lot. Like People are like, you have a problem, right? And I'm like, no. I really think the Taliban could take over America if they started with the internet. Mm. <laughs> Taliban's got some. I will say this. Taliban's was, got some okay ideas. I was looking at the Met. Yeah. I was looking at the Met Gal or whatever that was. The Met. Uh, Taliban wouldn't let that happen. The dresses, all that yeah. shit. And then I was looking at, there was a video of the Taliban hitting a lady with a stick. And I was like, I think. <laughs> I wouldn't even finish the joke. That's so good. That's so good right here. You know, Patrice wouldn't finish the joke. Yeah, yeah, Patrice yeah. would leave it right there. He'd go, I think. <laughs> and look, I think they'd have to stretch before this event. I think we need a middle ground. Middle Eastern studies, U.S. government. And you no, went to middle Did government. they tell you who did 9-11 in college? <gasps> No. Fuck, it's bullshit. It's secret no. safe, Ari. <laughs> <laughs> you edit that out, please. What kind of shit did they teach you about? Well, I'll, he I said yes. I, I mean, all the. <laughs> I, I tried to learn Arabic, but it was too hard. True. It was fucking hard. You Do you remember any words? Barakalaufik. Uh, you just that made that up, no, dude. That was racist that as hell. <laughs> no, that means, uh, like, and then there's, you know, inshallah. And then, obviously, uh, go with God. Yeah. Inshallah. Inshallah. Uh, yeah. Chleb. You, you, now you're making That's it. That's a dog. What? Chleb. Okay. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> My brother in law is an Arab. I fucking hate him. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me sick, dude. I might join the CIA now to go over there and fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see that new CIA commercial? No, join the CIA. What? Yeah. No. Oh, the girl one? Did what you the see fuck? it? Is it? You're talking about Homeland? No, it basically <laughs> is. It, really? Claire, There's Claire a, Danes. I don't know what it is. There's like an ad for the CIA. It's like what? a video of this Latina woman. Yeah. She Latin. literally is like, I am Latina. And she's like, I'm a, she's like, I suffer from anxiety disorder. She's just like one of those, she's a woke. And she's joining the CIA. And she's in the CIA. What the fuck? Why would they? Why would they? Use and they're advertising as, it. They're like, look like how the, powerful these kick-ass women are in the CIA. Wow, it's insane. Whoa. I don't understand. Are it, they? Dude, are they you, saying like? You yeah, can they're have... trying to destroy the family. They're going to take all of the wives and put them in the CIA. Obviously, this is the next level. <laughs> it's the crazy. And also, every single military commercial is like, "I'm a black woman in the Air Force." Yeah. <laughs> like, what? Those commercials are Nobody knows how to be what. So they're it's just like, like go, oh, black go, stuff. We'll do black stuff. Get Especially having to. the military be woke. They like just come out of like bombing a small yeah. village, and they're like, "What are we doing, black ladies?" All right. That's they nice. used to properly so target words while they bombing the village. <laughs> yeah. They had the best white trash ads. It was like, are you ready to climb a mountain and fight a fucking dragon? We do yeah. more. Yeah, and we every more poor white guy was like, hell yeah. yeah. Are you ready to face your worst tattoo? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. But last night, my dad, my dad's getting old. I was, I was with him last night and he tried to, Tried to make it go into space joke. And he's like, what are you, Jeff Boros? It's <laughs> <laughs> like, who? And he goes, huh? <laughs> like, he knew he was wrong. And then he didn't. He tried to pretend he didn't say it. He's like, what? He was like, who'd you say? He's like, Jeff. <laughs> Boros. <laughs> Jeff Boros. He makes up George Soros and Jeff Boros. <laughs> yeah, he became an old man. Oh, yeah. It's funny to just, just be like, what'd you just say? He's like, what? What? <laughs> Gnarly. Gnarly people, dude. That's it's not acceptable. You guys don't take your shoes off and 
No. Not not to bare feet. No, I of mean, course not. No, that I'm is, joking. That's fucking insane. I, I got, I, you know, I'm they, gonna start popping my shirt off. I wish a lot you of people would. don't do that. Yeah, that's a new. Just movie. right when you sit down, pants, <laughs> pants, <laughs> straight <Yeah>. to underwear. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Getting comfy. <laughs> this is a question we've done. But like, what's the how do we word it? What's like the fiercest. biggest, the fiercest animal you think you could take? Shit. Like a like an angry raccoon. You think you could beat up a raccoon? S- a, yeah, yes. oh, yeah. I do. Here's, on a raccoon. But here's the thing about raccoons. You're not with dude, your bare paws. If they yes. come, dude. Yes. If they come you at you, squeeze it. Today. You'd have to get it. But here's the thing. You'd have to. Be cool with getting bit and scratched yeah, you're gonna a bunch. Get bit and Your scratch. hands are going to get ripped of up. Of course. And you're, and you're confident you're not going to be like, ah, get away. Uh, well, like I mean, I'll definitely do that, but is this a fight to the death or is this yeah, just yeah, a yeah, few yeah, times? Yeah. I'm not going to kill I got a raccoon <laughs> if I run into one. Right, right. I mean, like, it's a fight. <laughs> that would be a weird <laughs> vow to make in your life. I'm not going like, to see a raccoon and be like, there's that motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> just, we're just with Shane going on a hike and he's like, hey, guys, hold this real quick. Told you, motherfucker. He's pulled out of the bush. <laughs> it's like impossible to be good at comedy when you're young or like to find success in, hard, in yeah. uh, stand up when you're young, right? What do you yeah. think like the threshold age is? Is it like 27 or something when people like start dying all. from heroin and stuff yeah, like yeah, that? Yeah. When like, people around you are really falling apart. <laughs> yeah. Some yeah, shit like yeah, that. Yeah. Like you can't be like who who's been really famous really young other than like Dave Chappelle or like or Eddie, like, Murphy. Uh, Eddie Murphy. There's a lot of those guys that I think those guys <laughs> Eddie Murphy, Dave Chappelle. No, there's a lot of those guys, <laughs> young guys. Yeah, what yeah. are you making this racial for? <laughs> I just, I, no, but that black guys are funny. Young, I'm, I'm trying black to guys, big them up. Black guys are funny. Yeah. Oh my At God. all ages, they're the funniest. Yeah, yeah they, they are. are. Yeah. There's no denying it. Yeah, it's tough, dude. We're fucking, we're fighting an uphill battle. They're funny. Yeah, man. <laughs> it's fucking tough. Yeah, and well, they can say it. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> I was gonna ask you. I was gonna ask you as a question, and it was gonna be a trick question, like whether you thought you could beat your dad up. And the trick question is, if you even think about that, you're fucking trash. Because intelligent, classy people yeah. don't think about fist fighting their own dad. <laughs> well, We've I'll all tell you thought what. about it. I literally, before this podcast started, he and I had that debate uh, in the kitchen today, <laughs> and he, because I, you know, I squared up to him and like jabbed him a little. And joking around he, yeah of course and okay. then he he was like i'll i'll fuck you up and i was like i would beat the fuck out of you and this was in front of my mother so yeah. Dude, I yeah. mean, maybe it's not all class over she, <laughs> no, she ba- it's not it's she not, backs dude. your dad up she backs your old man up like yeah he'll kick your fucking ass James. oh he's done that so one time uh i came out of the bathroom and my dad fucking towel whipped me in the face. Like I, oh, he was doing laundry, which is right what are outside you in a of the frat bathroom. house. What's going? It was on? insane. He towel whipped me in the face, <laughs> and then I fucking grabbed the towel, and he hid behind my mother. Ooh. And I was like, I was like, if Joan, you better move, or I'm gonna fucking towel whip you. <laughs> and she stayed still. So I towel whipped her, and normally I'm bad at towel whipping, but I fucking, it was a perfect crack, and she started Snapper. crying. Oh, <laughs> and my dad went from like, oh, this is playful, to just in my fucking face. <laughs> like, he was, he hit his he was, girl. He got, yeah, he got in my face and was just like, I'll fuck you up, you pussy. I remember you called me a pussy. <laughs> He called me a pussy. Dude, my dad's called me a pussy so many times. It was crazy. Did your da- didn't your dad sleep in church? No. That's, that was the old joke in my family. He would all- hit me. Well, yeah. I would be hit throughout church. That's why he goes to church. Yeah. You're allowed to hit your son in church. He would slap me in church constantly. In the where? Back of the head, dude. Yeah, back of the head. Back of the head or flick. Flick to to the ear, the neck. Oh, fuck. I used to talk about these, the crown crown cracks. (laughs) I used to get those all the time. Startling, dude. Dude, I hated it so much. (laughs) And your teeth would knock together a little bit. I hit, fucking hated that. Just being a father and being like, shut the fuck up to your son. <laughs> just in front of just church. <laughs> people and in people your community. People behind you. People sitting directly behind you just watching a dad like, fuck, mother, pay yeah, attention. But they, they love it. Those, they must have been like, these people are out of their fucking minds. Really? They had to. I feel like that was normal to If I went like, to church and saw a dad slapping his son in the back of the head out of actual anger, mm-hmm. I'd be like, what the fuck are you doing? Dude? Yeah, but do you have your own son at that point? No. Because then you'd get it. Do you know what I mean? True. I feel like the dads that saw the other dads do it were like, "Yeah, it's like, like a you nod." Fucking see that? Uh-huh. You see that abusive uh-huh. done? <laughs> you could have an abusive dad. Keep fucking talking. Keep keep it up. Keep, keep it up, smiling. Riley. You eight year old that I'm making sit through the homily, <laughs> <laughs> a forty five minute homily. <laughs> Did you guys go every weekend? Yeah. Yeah, you never missed, huh? I did. I had to go during school too. I went to Catholic school, so I'd go once a week. In I went to church twice a week for like. <sighs> 
15 years. Wow. Well, 10 years. Wow. Yeah, man. A fucking nightmare. A lot of church. Too much. Too much church. None of it stayed, though, huh? I remember it. You know what I mean. Did you ena- are you do you have any religion do you have any spirituality? No, no, no. no, I don't. I don't. But I like Catholicism. Like I, I would identify as a Catholic, I guess. Still. Yeah. What like what about it? What do I like about the What do you why do you Catholic think you would faith? say Yeah, why do you think you'd identify? <laughs> well, because I hate abortion and what Texas is doing is correct. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. That's how that's how I was raised. It's more it's like being Jewish. Yeah, no. But it's, it's like not. no, they don't be true. It's not like <laughs> nothing at all. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, talk to the boss man. Yeah, what type talk, of- yeah. What should he? What should he say? Talking to the boss man. Should he be like bold? Should he be like? Uh, should he like kiss the ring? Like should he genuflect or should he be like I'm the shit? Uh, Find a medium. I don't know Dave at all personally. I would imagine you got to kiss the ring a little. <laughs> But here's another thing you do. You could black out. Yeah. Before. <laughs> That's a good idea. And then let it ride. And I was then you thinking about know. doing that. You won't even know Having how the meeting went. Beers. Yeah. And just kind of find out, like, find based out. on his response <laughs> yeah. like, later on. Yeah, get an email that night. <laughs> and be like, like, well, you're fired. fired. Yeah. <laughs> like, ah, shit. So you're on the plane. You're next to the lady. Yeah, I toughed it out. You could have taken what's yours. You didn't. I could have shoved her. <laughs> you could have had. But, dude, when you, I, I haven't said. You could have had a lot of fun. You, like, you didn't. There's no, there's no, it was me and another unit. Mm-hmm. It was two units. Between? She had to sit in the middle of two units. We were already sitting down. She she was the last one to sit. Oh, she was and probably I was, I was so looking at the width between me and that dude. It was fucking insane. Oh, dude. It was literally. That's it was a girl's like dream, dude. Two units just protecting oh, you. If we got like, in a plane crash, she would have survived. <laughs> <laughs> she would have been in a bubble. It would be like the revenant when he goes inside of the horse and <laughs> yeah, survived. <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> she would have made it. Dude, she would. She probably the whole time was wanting nothing more for you guys just to like fully lean, lean into her, just to feel it. Snuggle into it. It's like warmth. double daddies, dude. At once, <sighs> all your daddies wait on you. Just two daddies lean against you. You're flying. She was probably like, oh, fuck. yeah. If, if you could get past, the, yeah, that would actually be nice to just snuggle for three yeah. hours. That'd be a new genre. Snuggling on just, flights, just with a lady guys. getting creamed by two big units, dude. Ooh, <laughs> that actually sounds pretty good. Yeah, dude. I mean, I've definitely watched that. <laughs> It's tossing around. Lady like, getting tossed around by two units. Just visible displays of strength. They wouldn't even have to pen. Just dudes like tossing a lady up, like, Ugh. yeah. Laying on her. She's like, oh. <laughs> no penetration. But no pen at all. Just squashing. Just it. you lay on. The dude lays on you and just squ- squash. <laughs> squash. <laughs> squash. Porn. It's just middle aged ladies, too. We're going to squirt her. You squirt her. <laughs> squirt <laughs> porn. You're squirting her, dude. I squirt. And it's dry humping, dude. I'll squirt your lady, dude. I'll squirt the hell out of a lady. <laughs> dry humping, dude. <laughs> Dry humping only. There's a devil's through some dry hump. You ever knock the wind out of a lady when you squirt her? I never squirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta fucking you gotta the get devil's through some squirt. That'd be nice, dude. That's what this lady got. Or the guy on the, the guy's on the very bottom. He's like, oh, dude, you're uh, so heavy. And you're like, yeah, wait till it's my turn. Yeah, lay her across. She's like, uh, Lincoln log it, Lincoln log it, just smash her. Oh, oh, oh. That's a nice squirt. Yeah, so she was dreaming about that. The whole How do you time. not crumb though? If we're playing like fun wrestling squirt with girls, yeah, you're gonna get hard. Yeah. Oh, I also had a boner for the entire flight. The yeah, one, not that one, not that one, not that one. A lot of times they say yeah. you get too fucked up to finish the games. He would just get fucked up and kind yeah. of wane that's, away. Dude, that's the that's what announcers should be. I know, dude. Just a guy getting fucking ripped watching a game. Yeah, now you have Joe Buck. Yeah, people hate Joe Buck. I don't mind. I'm right here. Really? I don't hate him as a guy. Yeah. I don't like him as an announcer. Yeah. I think his dad was great. Tony Romo is nice. Dude, I like Tony Romo. This is a guy that surprised the country. Yeah. When they were like, he's going to be an announcer. Everyone, you, yeah. me, everyone you know would have been like, I don't know, man. Yeah. He seems corny. He crushes. Yeah. Anytime I listen to him, Dude, I'm when like, he's just like the third best. and five, they're going to hit a quick out. Guy bottom of the screen. He goes, now what? Right now, away. He goes, keep, your, keep, keep your eyes on the linebacker right here. Watch what he's going to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And he it's literally awesome. does exact. Awesome. Oh, it's yeah, brilliant. That's cool. I feel like Peyton Manning wanted to be that guy. And Tony Romo was like, I'm. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. Yeah. Because Peyton is really good at calling stuff, you see, but I think Tony is so keen that it's almost scary. Where It's savant yeah. shit where you're like, is he, is he a genius? Yeah, it just shows you how untalented he was. <laughs> he just knew everything that knew was about to happen. Yeah. And, and still, still kind of sucked. <laughs> <laughs> he was ground level. He was like, I know you're going there. I'm going to try to throw the ball. Oh, you got it. You picked it off. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. Instagram's down hey, right these now. These boomers have yeah. nothing to jerk off to. <laughs> yeah. What a, what a story. <laughs> uh, yeah, are they going to get their pro or anti Instagram, tweets My Instagram reels are wild right now. Yeah? Uh, yeah? Oh, my God. Are yours? 
Mine are just the hottest girls ever. <laughs> Every day. Oh, and then, not the ones you're posting. The ones you're no, seeing. No, no, no. The yeah. ones. That, my oh, yeah. algorithm is full pedophile at this point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, they lock me weird in. That they, they are can locking do that? me in. Yeah, the Chinese. Yeah. The Chicoms. The Chicoms are locking us in. <laughs> <laughs> the Chicoms have locked me into being a pedophile. But it is interesting. And there's nothing I can do about it. Do you think that's the, what they're trying to do? They're trying to. Yeah, they're trying to box you in and then get you in trouble. Uh, yeah, probably. But yeah, yeah, Instagram's down, and this is how addicted I am to it. Like three different times in the Uber here, I still try. I kept opening it to see maybe. Oh, just kept opening, not even to see. I'd be like, oh yeah, it's closed. And then I would go back to the other shit on my phone. Just mindlessly go, go to on Instagram. It. Yeah, and I'd be like, oh yeah, it's down. Yeah, I'm it's incredibly addicted, but somehow I haven't been on it. But yeah, I do it all the time mindlessly. I'm. I mean to do something else, and I'm like, why am I on Instagram? Yeah, why am I on Twitter? What am I doing? Dude, you're so good at Instagram. <laughs> yeah, you're so good at it. Dude. I'm not good at any of the internet, <laughs> except finding young women on it. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>